Hey guys, it's Erica. We're gonna be checking out Odd Eye Circle Janice Qua performance video. This is the fixed version. So excited to be checking this out because it's gonna be a first time listening to the song, but also seeing the choreography. And they really killed the Air Force One choreography. So I'm really excited to be seeing what they are doing with this one. And I feel like just the phrase Janice Qua kind of works with Odd Eye Circle very well. So I'm, I'm really excited. Uh, so yes, yeah, so, let's so not waste any more time. And you know what it like. Oh. I fumble my words a lot. Ooh. They're very statuesque there at the beginning. Ooh, pretty. And clean. Nice. Ooh. Okay. It's a very odd eye circle sound. Nice. Yo, they. The way they dance. Like, are we watching the same thing? That's. It's like the way they dance is always like perfect. Nice. I'm really loving trio choreographies. Ooh. And then down. Nice. They are so clean, man. Talk about synchronization. Nice. Ooh. Nice. But yeah, the certain sort of, like pictures they create with trios, I really love. How did they dance so perfect? I also realize they're in a subway set, and that's kind of pulls into their, I guess, the lore of the group. Um, yeah, no, I really like this song. I like it. It sounds very odd-eyed circle of a song, so I really love it that the sound that they're at least going for so far is not something so out of what we know Odd Eye Circle to do, you know? Um, even if it's been so many years, it still has all that vibe there, and I really love it. The way they dance, the way they perform is always like, it's, it's like the closest to perfection you could ever get. They have this sort of, it, it looks like an effortless feel or effect, but it's just that they are performing the moves to the just right amount. They are doing the choreography, but they're not necessarily going so extra with it. And I think that's why it's so beautiful to watch it. It makes it very, it's, it's, instead of like, I guess, individual, I like they are very much individual performers, but like there are certain groups to where they allow their members a little bit more individuality when it comes to dancing and performing in the choreography, but they are always so tight knit, so uniform. It is so beautiful to see. And I really like that they bring that to the table because that's not something like other groups always do, um, which I, I like both. I like both. I like getting the variety. No hate to the groups that do the individual stuff, but seeing something here is definitely something to be appreciated. They are so clean. They are, it, it is absolutely insane and it kind of looks like the choreography isn't super intense or whatever but what they are doing is doing the moves exactly like if it's if it's something as simple as this it is literally just it's just this and that's what you want it to be there is no movement there is no shake with other part of their bodies like sometimes if you see 
much more dancers of groups. They had they're much like they may not always be like the flashiest, but they have the most like control, and they always put in the like exact amount of effort into where into what needs to be where what what part of their body needs to be like enhanced you know what i mean like if you're doing like if you're doing something like this and it's like uh, somebody else does it like this there's a lot more chest movement in there versus it just being this they have so much control over their body it is so beautiful to see it is very much an expertise over the choreography and the way they have of their body you know they do everything to like again the most level of perfection and just giving giving effort but not making it in like not overdoing the effort. Like they're still performing, they're still looking pretty, they're still doing everything, they're still doing the choreography beautifully. And that is some of just what makes them so great is that sort of that effortless look that it has. They're putting in effort, but they just they just do the move just just ex exactly what it needs to be. Nothing too extra, nothing too less. It is always just at a such an exact specific level that it just needs to be it is always just enough and it's never never too much i mean there were a little parts there when it would go like when it, when it would be like this member here this member here and then the member in the center where they would turn it up a little bit so we know that they can and previous seen them dance for previous choreographies we know they can but um for sure here they just have a level of expertise and control over their body and it just it works so well for their style of choreography that they do and we haven't really well i didn't i haven't checked out a whole lot of any previous covers they might have done uh under luna but like for sure seeing what they do um as like a group and stuff it is it's so nice to get this just such a specific style for like a girl group like this and i'm so in love with it i love it i think it's great choreography i really like the song as well um yeah it was really great going to put your thoughts and comments down below to that about odd eye circles jenna sequa performance music video performance video excuse me the fixed version if you like this video give this video a thumbs up if you liked me and want to see more of my videos go and hit that subscribe button if you want to see my videos the second they come out hit that notification button if you want to follow me on social media, Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, threads, or description down below, or at the end screen. If you like gaming content, I have a gaming channel. It's called Erica Just Games. Links in the description down below. Currently playing The Last of Us Part 2. I hope you can join me over there for that. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. Love you, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. <laughs>